controlling someone like this. Oh, I saw a video of somebody doing it. Why? What is the intent behind the control? We have the overhook. And now my objective is I kind of stay here a little bit because I want him to get his arm out. And the only way is bring his arm in front of you. You know that. You might think you don't know that. You might think, oh, shit. I'm already waiting for that. As soon as he gets out, man, this arm is hit. And now is the thing, people want to pull guard, but I'm too close to him. You have to learn that he create his space. Then you can make him roll. But I gave him the room for him to roll. I want to make sure that we all know what we can do once we get here. As soon as he gets out, look, there we go. I want to now switch to take his back. No, I want to hold him. Stretch him out. Good. Now I can go over and take the back. But I want to make sure that I'm outside his frame. How can I get outside my opponent's frame? Gotta get his arm here. Now I have all of this. And every time I get on the side, evidently my opponent is going to defend. But remember the table work? I'm not working my upper body. Legs too. I'm trying to defend now. And this is the thing. Stay there for a second. Arm bar. All I need is the arm straight. And you can even come up with a new arm bar. It's just the idea of the arm straight. Then I can go and get the arm. Mm. Okay. Oh, his arm is bent. Good. The neck is exposed. Uh -oh. oh, I don't want any of this. I want to improve my control. Good. Back. And doesn't make sense to me sometimes. I'm away 110 pounds. He weighs 200. Bring him on top of me. Hell no. <laughs> 110, 110 on him. And stretch. Make uncomfortable. It's my hip. Okay? Because a lot of things in Jiu-Jitsu works on your partner's mind. He feels the pressure. And it's a good compliment when somebody goes to you and says, Man, you're strong. And you know you did not use your strength, you're using your weight. That means, oh, I'm using my weight properly. He said I'm strong and he's bigger than me. That means my weight is being effective. Make the control, elbow up, you know that arm's gonna come up. As soon as I come up, switch, I'm hugging here. Now I have all these options. Hold tight here and use your legs. I can base my hand back up from him. Here we go, switch my leg and you have the back. And I always use all four. All four, it's not just no, here, 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 here. It's all four working. I mean, he has to be ready for one, two, three, four. Normally, we just go like, no, boom, spread, spread him out. He has no base. There's <laughs> no base now. Oh, he gets his arm out. Good, nice, look at this, switch. There we go. And you always end up in a better position. Let's do it. Make the control, he gets out, switch. And from there, I want you to be creative. But it's always this. My arms, all four working together. It has to be doing four steps, not one. Okay, one, two, three. 